What's up, guys? My name is Chris. This is uh, Rage Diver Gaming, and I'm just starting to change my channel up a bit. And I've mostly been focused on gaming because that's kind of what I was into. But I wanted you guys to know that there's going to be some really cool new content coming. I'm really working hard to learn the business of YouTube, to learn how to stream, to learn how to be professional. Um, so I thought I'd take this opportunity to give you a quick background on who I am, why you should watch my content, why you should care. Um, so, okay. So, all right. So I started out uh, my career in the military. Uh, after I got out of high school, I went to a small town in Ohio, middle of nowhere, uh, practically West Virginia. So if you'll note, if you'll note that, the, maybe the southern in my accent, I'm not from the south, but I kind of have a little bit of twang. And uh, that's just because that's where I grew up. So my whole family is military. My dad was in uh, the Navy. He was in the, in the 50s. He was an electronics technician. He was on an icebreaker. My grandfather was in the 82nd Airborne, Korea. Actually parachuted into one of the play, the bases that I was assigned to, which is awesome. Uh, what used to be called Camp Drum, which is now Fort Drum. So, so fast forward from uh, 98 to 2002, I went to school at the United States Naval Academy. And if you don't know anything about the Naval Academy, it's where the future officers of the Navy and Marine Corps essentially go to college. They earn a four-year degree, and they get commissioned and... Uh, become O1s in the Navy and Marine Corps, so second lieutenant uh, or an ensign. So there's a lot of different opportunities. It's not the only place the military gets its officers, but it, it's a place. It's a great place. It's, a, it's in a little town called Annapolis, Maryland. Highly recommend if you have a chance to visit or if you've got kids that are thinking about going there, message me. Uh, I can talk you through some of the process for that, my experiences, the good and bad. Um, so I graduated the academy. I got sent... Uh, here to lovely Panama City, where I'm actually uh, I reside currently with my three beautiful children. I'm actually uh, in my condo right now, which is right on a lagoon and across from the beach. So I really love it. Hope to get some more content up on this channel of that as well because I just I think you'll find that more interesting than just just another gaming channel. Um, so uh, in my professional life, uh, sorry, let me back up. So let me back up. So, so I got commissioned in the Navy. I uh, came here to Panama City, went through the dive school here, and got sent to a ship and did various other things, uh, deployed. I ended up switching to the Army in 2005, and I was a little bit concerned about doing it, but it was actually the best thing that ever could have happened to me. I got uh, my commission. I came over from the Navy as a O2, lieutenant engineer grade, to the Army as a first lieutenant. So I was brand new to the Army, knew nothing about it. I was the most senior guy and the officer basic course, and uh, it was really kind of scary on one hand because I didn't really know what to do. I didn't really know what acronyms were what. I hadn't been through all the other schools like most of everyone else. So I had a couple of, of good friends who were in the Navy, and then that helped me transition really easily. So 2005, I got sent to Fort Hood, which I love. I love Fort Hood. I love uh, Texas, one of the last few states uh, that's you know, just kind of rugged and independence. Beautiful land, beautiful uh Beautiful areas. It's a great tech area that Austin, the whole, it's kind of becoming the new Silicon Valley. So if you haven't had a chance to go there, definitely check it out. You got 6th Street. You got lots of lots of cool places to go. Um, so I ended up getting out of the active military, and now I'm actually a reservist, which is why I can kind of get away with this. But um, So I've been in the reserves for about five years now, and I'm working as a, a uh, IT consultant for a uh, startup right now, which I won't talk about here because we're kind of it's a security company. We, I don't like to talk about uh, those matters for reasons of security. So that said, I've worked on you know government contracts, all that kind of good stuff. Got several industry certifications. Uh, my passion is IT and also computers, uh, specifically mobile right now. And uh, I started out in programming uh, with my undergrad, and I finished up my master's in information assurance and cybersecurity. So when I'm talking to you about computer things, tech things, I'm doing so not from just a theoretical or a you know, I've actually had hands-on. I've done a lot of the things that um, I talk about. You know, I've implemented them. I've run servers. I've managed uh, email servers, VMs, Active Directory, all kinds of uh, Cisco routers, firewalls, switching, security systems, all the kind of stuff that you know you would want to uh, have in a high-level enterprise environment. So now I'm working uh, remotely, which I love. It's awesome. I think it's great. Um, I, if you have the opportunity to do so, I highly recommend it. It's, it takes some discipline initially, and you kind of feel like you're always at work, but then on one hand, you're always at your house. So 
But anyway, uh, that's my background. Uh, I hope it was interesting to you. This is my uh, kind of first official intro video. Not sure if I'm going to rename the channel, if that's even a thing that I can do, but uh, I don't want it to be just a gaming channel. I did originally start this one to be gaming tech, phones, uh, retro gaming, uh, we talk military, fitness, uh, all different kinds of things. So anyhow, thank you so much for watching. Subscribe, follow me on Twitter. The links will be below. Uh, Instagram, all that good stuff. I do a lot of different side projects. So, And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks.